Welcome to Zugmo, your online backup community. Thanks for checking us out. In this short video, we're going to provide you an overview of our cool backup application, so you can start building your personal backup network and protecting your data. Our tour begins after you have downloaded and installed Zugmo. First, let's run Zugmo. If you've not yet opened an account, you will need to click on Create an Account. This link will take you to our website, where you can create a new account with our secure server. It is really important for you to carefully select your password and make sure that you remember it. Zugmo does not store an accessible copy of your password on our server, so if you forget it, you will not be able to access or restore your backed up files. This is how we ensure that your personal stuff remains accessible only to you. Please be sure to use a valid email address when opening your new account. We respect your privacy and will only use your email address to communicate with you about important Zugmo related topics. Once you've created an account, return to the Sign in to Zugmo dialog box and fill in your username and password. Zugmo will always open in the Partners view. This is where you are able to add and remove partners and manage backup space allocations. Remember, with Zugmo, your backup network can consist of your own computers or your friends. You can even back up to home servers, external hard drives, and USB flash drives. This is also where you can initiate backup or restore by clicking on the buttons. You can also back up or restore directly from the system tray without even needing to open the application by right-clicking on the Zugmo icon and selecting either backup or restore. The other view you will find of interest is the categories view. This is where you can see which of your data Zugmo has selected for backup. We automatically scan the desktop and my documents directories and organize all your files and folders into pre-built categories that contain those file types that are common to most users. Checks next to items means they are selected for backup. Squares next to categories means that some files in the category are selected while others are not. Files appearing in red are too large for the current beta version and will not be backed up. You can also view and select unselect files in the Files view, which is the more standard Explorer style presentation. At the bottom of the screen, there's status information so you can keep track of how much you've backed up and whether you're getting close to reaching your quota of backup space. If the size of the selected backup exceeds your quota, you can deselect categories or individual files until you are under your quota. Or you can either add new partners or request more space from current partners. Finally, we have the Advanced Features view, where you can manage various aspects of the application. Check out our Advanced Features video if you would like to learn more about some of Zugo's more techie features. All you have to do now is click Backup and let Zugmo take care of the rest. Remember that all of your files are encrypted both before leaving your computer, while crossing the internet, and while stored on your partner's computers using state-of-the-art encryption technology. Please remember that we are in beta development, and so Zugmo is not yet feature complete. In this current version, you can only back up with one partner. There's a maximum file size of 50 megabytes, and you will need to press the backup button each time you want to backup. Expect a new version release with major improvements to this functionality in a very short time. See the Frequently Asked Questions section of our website, or use the Contact Us link if you have additional questions about Zugmo. We appreciate your choosing Zugmo, and are so glad that you have taken the important step of protecting your data while building your personal backup network. Be sure to tell your friends about Zugmo. You can use the Tell a Friend link on our website, www.zugmo.com.